Amiglin on the Loose TV, and we're here for Habitat for Humanity. And who are we speaking to? Uh, John McCormick, Mayor of Woodbridge, the great town of Woodbridge. Wonderful, the town of Woodbridge. This is where it's happening. This is this is where it's happening. I mean, what a great team! Best senator. Two great teams. Two great teams. Wonderful. Well, one great team and Team Vitali. I mean, they get someone to play them every year, which is great. It is great. It's a great event. It's a great cause, and I'm very very proud of you know my affiliation with with Joe Vitali. We're very good friends. He's a great senator. He's just great humanitarian, and today shows why. And uh, how are you affiliated with Habitat for Humanity, Mayor? Uh, personally, other than we sponsor you know part of this every year through our charity fund, um, I. I've never participated, but just through Joe, I know a lot about it, and I'm happy to help any way we can. Right, and you're here tonight, and you're helping, and obviously you don't have to be here, but you're here while well, you are the mayor. So it's a pleasure having you here today, and uh, tell me about the team, more about the team, and you know how this team in particular is involved with events that are reaching out to the community. Well, I used to play for the team years ago. Um, I played a lot of years ago and I played for many, many years, but I stopped um, a couple, maybe two years ago I didn't play, last year I didn't play, this year I was going to play, but I hurt my knee and I can't play. I'm 55, I'm too old to play softball. Uh, I mean, Vitaly's even older than me and he's playing, but he doesn't play very well. So I don't want to, I don't want to exactly look like Joe Vitaly when I'm You don't want me to laugh on air, do you? Yeah, you can. You can. <laughs> um, I know a lot of these guys, Joe's team is stacked. I mean, he, he recruited some serious ball players. That guy just put the ball to the fence. So... And you know who's pitching out there, right? You know who's pitching. Oh, is that Bert? That is the Bert oh Barron. No wonder we're going to win. <laughs> That's Bert Barron. I wasn't paying attention. I just know I love Bert. I love Bert. I've been on his show I know. Times. He's cool. He is so cool. But no, I just noticed he was, when you said something, I noticed he was pitching. Um, look, it's great for CTC to chip in. Uh, and help out with the with the, the fun, you know fundraising and giving an opponent. It's just great. It's great. So tell me about Woodbridge. Tell me the accomplishments. Maybe if you can give me the condensed version of anything um, recent taking place. We have the best run town I think in the state. Our public now works department second to none. Our Harris. police department department no second to none. Nationally accredited. We have a great functioning town. Harry. Right now our focus is nothing but economic development. We want to bring more jobs in town. We want to bring office buildings, warehouses. Uh, retail, well, we just opened Boscov's, 300 some odd jobs. We've got Amazon.com bringing 500 jobs to a warehouse. That's our focus right now. We have a lot of residents out of work. Um, the government runs well, my people run it well. Now, my focus is getting more companies into town. Spread the tax burden out and take a lot of the people in town who lost their jobs due to the economy, get them jobs. Wonderful, wonderful. And we're here helping with Habitat for Humanity. Look, there's so many great causes in town. And I'm looking around at some of the people here, and I've seen them at all different events, whether it's veterans events or scout events or school events. You know, got, got a guy like Dan Harris who's on the Board of Ed, you know, helping out here. You've got people in the audience who are on all kinds. There's Eddie Gorman. He survived Normandy. He's in the American Legion uh, in Island. There's Casimir. He's involved in... Uh, uh, the Avenel Fire Department. There's all That's kinds of people here that make the town good, that make the town great, because we have so many volunteers and so many people working to raise money for causes like Habitat for Humanity. I just think it makes this town really legitimately the best around. And isn't that what it's all about? People coming together and just, you know, coming for a cause that's so worthy as this. I mean, and what a, what a wonderful night to play baseball, right? I think Joe said rain once. I think one year it got rained out, but every other year Joe's had great weather, and who knows? And who knows? And who is this the uh, 16th annual uh, I've event? Been here for seven, I think I've been here for seven, but I don't know how far it goes before that. Okay. I know. Down behind me, you know, somebody's getting a lot of hits here. It's a pretty scary prospect. I mean, the team is outrageous. Both teams are great. They both are working hard. Thank you so much, Mayor yeah, McCormick. Thanks, and thanks for all you're doing to cover this and give it publicity. Really do appreciate you spending your time. No Thank you so much. Uh -huh.